Yo, y'all, this is what's happening seven, and today I'm gonna keep playing Earthbound. Um, last time I filled with my inventory with random. Whoops. I filled my inventory with random shit that I don't need and I can't seem to sell. And, uh. Yeah. <laughs> Let's see. I wonder if I can discard stuff. Drop. Shouldn't throw the for sale sign away. Okay, look. What happens then? What do I- am I just stuck with this forever now? What happens when I have so many permanent items that I don't have any space for like- Maybe I can buy a backpack later on in the game. I have a backpack! That's what I'm storing all this in. I don't know. An extended backpack. If you go to the east, you can run into trouble. Alright, we already talked to you. People in Happy Happy Village are fanatical about a strange religion. Maybe we've got some- Oh, I also already talked to you. Hello. I hear that a girl named Carla was kidnapped while helping out of the Polestar Preschool. Happy, happy village ahead. Okay. Gotta watch out for mushrooms and leeches. Or slugs, I guess, not leeches. Peaceful rest valley ahead, proceeding through the cave. That's cool. I like the music. It's like a... Oh, I shouldn't have turned away. I always forget about that. Mobile Sprout. Alright, sure. 11 of... 11 HP. Sweet. Okay. So they have around 100 hit points. I think. But anyway... I think that the, look the, ugh, excuse me, the theme song in that cave is similar to the ant cave, but it's uh, it's like a remix. Hum de dum dum dum. I'm hunting for mushrooms. I'm gonna collect a ton. Oh my god! What the fuck is this? Confront the little UFO. <laughs> Fired up. Oh my god. Dodge quickly, okay. Uh, goods. No! That's not what I meant. But nothing happened. Of course. Ah! It's been forever since I saved. Oh, do I have all those items? Maybe. I hope. Okay, good. Actually, in retrospect, it probably would have been better if I didn't have the items. <laughs> so, I mean, selling stuff does not seem... Unless it's equipment, it doesn't actually seem to do me, like, any good. What is this? If you have time to read this, go to the Chaos Theater immediately. Uh, you know, I'm gonna do that in case there is actually, like, something scripted where if I read that, and if I hoof it to the Chaos Theater. I'll take that. Is there anything new in here? Alright. You know, I think it would be pretty interesting to see, like, a corruption for this game or something. I mean, I'd love to look one up, but I haven't actually finished the game. Oh, hey, you're new. C Carla's not home yet. Ever, uh, Everdred in Berglin Park might know something. Oh, boy, now nah, I'm really worried. Yeah, I know. I'm... I'm I'm on the trail. I just got killed by a small spaceship.
I really do wish it was called a spaceship and not a mini UFO. Because a UFO is just, I mean, that's just an unidentified flying object. Not fucking, it doesn't mean a spaceship. I mean, you can, there's a, you can have a meteor be a UFO. I thought that that was twice as tall for a sec. <laughs> Alright. Sigh. Comp S. Sweet. Oh, so they have 80 points of health. Are you... <sighs> there. <laughs> Sorry. That'll teach those fucking sprouts. Okay, the UFO isn't there anymore, but there's another combat mole. I'm not an enemy, I'm just a regular mole. Would you like to know how to survive battles? Sure. You may have uh, noticed that when you have been badly hurt in battle, you may survive a mortal attack and still have one HP. I honestly haven't. If this has happened, it was because of your guts. Your survival may depend on your guts level. Also, more guts help you get more SMASHING hits. Beyond guts, you should have noticed that it takes some time for damage to be taken from you. This is because of the rolling action of the HP meter. Uh, HP meter. Oops, I mean your life. If an enemy deals more damage to you, but you defeat all the enemies before your life is gone, you survive. This is all I know. Okay. Purple water. That's weird. Holy shit, that guy is... You can see why he dodged everything. He's not very deadly. And he only seems to have a single attack. And he's also not very tough. But he dodges things all the fucking time. It would seem... Cross bridge to happy happy village. Can I talk to this guy, maybe? Dang. Well, I'd rather not. <laughs> Alright. Oh, fuck. No! Oh, boy. I hate it when that happens. Alright, here we go. Sigh. That. A beam! No. Okay, that's not very much. That's enough. What do you mean I- Oh my. That's dumb. And your HP is maxed out, so everything that I just did has been absolutely pointless. Well, I hope I don't die. Of course I missed. Of course. Of course. Of course. Of course. Uh, of course. Okay. Let's see. Uh... Thank God. 96 HP. Okay, well... Okay, good. God, okay. Those two as a combination fucking suck. Because nighttime stiffness. I think it's very dumb that I absolutely have to... Is that a pencil? Um, that I have to go to a hospital to fix that. Carton of cream. Use? Ate the carton of cream. Well, that's not quite what I had in mind. What was that red flash? Okay, well. Um. Croissant. Oh, shit. Sweet. Nothing. Damn. I'm starting to think that red flash had something to do with something. For some weird reason, a pencil-shaped iron statue was blocking the path. That is definitely weird. Yeah, it keeps flashing red. I... For like a single frame. Uh, 
Is that that nighttime stiffness bullshit? <laughs> Sniffling. Not stiffness. Sniff. Sniffness? Uh, that's starting to be as, if not more, annoying uh, than the mushroom. Oh my god, that's horrible. How the hell do I get across? This whole thing was totally pointless. It just cost me a lot of time and money. Ah. Uh, well. Yeah, there's nothing. Is there maybe a hill on the left side? Like maybe this is a cave? No? Maybe I gotta explore Tucson a little more. Oh, when the fuck did that spawn? No, 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 no. <laughs> All right. Oh my lord. Oh well. Are you fucking kidding? Oh, good. Uh, sneezed and received HP. Oh, four HP damage. Cool. That's that. That makes sense. I sneezed so hard that I dropped dead. You know, it's probably happened before. Oh, so that red flashing was probably damage that was being dealt. Yeah. Ugh. Sorry. Yeah, that would make sense. Or more sense, anyway. So let's see how much of that was actually saved. Yeah, that was definitely all saved. Okay. Well, uh... Huh. Well, with that bridge, is there a town hall here? I mean, I'd assume. Oh, there's just a walkway to Threed. Alright. Let's go to Threed. Actually, I could try funding the, these two's uh, inventions, so let's do that. Greetings, I'm Orange Could- Oh, yes, I have already talked to you. Obviously. <laughs> oh, goody, would it be okay to- uh, oh. Sure, what? You don't have that much money? Well, perhaps you shouldn't be yapping about having that much cash, buddy. You make me want to just do anything but fund your fucking bullshit. This is a long road. <laughs> but a present, there's a skip sandwich inside. Yeah, sure. Wait a minute. Hmm. I'm off the map. Oh, no, I'll just stay the hell away from that thing. God. <laughs> Two three tunnel to the town of th to the town of three. <laughs> it's just a hunch, but I think the ghosts in the tunnel don't like any uh, don't like anything upbeat and cheerful. When I was driving in the tunnel, I was playing some grooving tunes, and the ghosts uh, moved slower. I think ghosts can't stand anything positive. Thanks for telling me that. I was about to use the skipping sandwich. Ooh, go back, go back. Nah, fam. Look, you can't stop me.
Go back, go back. Go back, go back. Huh. Positive. They can't stand anything positive. What the hell on me is positive in any way? I mean... I've probably got a bat that's covered in dried blood. I can't imagine that's too positive. Um. Oh yeah, I'm considerably faster. Not fast enough to... No, it stops me from moving. That's what I was afraid of. Oh, good. And the sandwich's effects are gone. I wonder if... Yeah, maybe I can just go around. No, I guess not. All the blue co colored people around here. That's probably my favorite track in the game. 56 to the New Age Retro Hippie. Wait, that's... that doesn't make sense. <laughs> New Age Retro Hippie. Huh. That is a... Um, an amalgamation of oxymorons. Random house that I... Don't think... What the hell? Where's the door? It's just a house with no door, I guess. Well... Hmm. I appear to be in a state in this game where... I really don't understand what to do. I can't go to the Happy Happy Village because the fucking bridge is broken. And those ghosts are stopping me from... All right, get out of here. New Age Retro Hippie. Actually, they're... The music is pretty good, so that makes it better. Well, anyways... Um... As I was saying, I... Can you- how are you faster than me? How- how is that even possible? And they're also quite a bit harder to fight. No, not quite a bit, I guess. But anyways... As I was saying... I have no idea what to do. I don't know- ooh, hey. Well, have I been in here? This does not look familiar. Hello. I told you a thousand times, Munch Munch. I won't join the happy, happy religious group, Munch Munch Munch. If you get pushy with me, I'll pelt you with peanuts. Okay. Hello. I have a lot of old broken junk, but I hate to throw anything away. If you have a friend who's knowledgeable about mechanics, that person might be able to fix something for you overnight. Man, a friend like that would be so handy. Meow. Do you hide it all behind your couch? Let's see... Uh, that's just the bus stop. Okay, um... I guess I'll withdraw any money that I've got in the bank account. Three hundred and seventy-four bucks, okay. That was just about the, uh, almost the sh longest amount of time that I could have possibly taken to get that, get that out. It was so hard for me to, I don't know, put in some numbers. <laughs> Alright, orange kid. Let's see. He seems more promising. 
But maybe, and since he's a bit of a dick, um, and the apple kid is not. No. Then, maybe I'll fund the apple kids instead. As long as it's not, like, ridiculously expensive. Hello, hello! Maybe you'd like to invest money in my inventions? Sure! Yes, yes, yes! Oh, excuse me. I mean, thank you. By the way, uh, I could really use 200 bucks. Sure. Thank you. I won't let you down. Thank you. I won't let you down. Okay, well, I... Um... You're kind of blocking my escape. I'm a mouse. You took care of my master. In return, I want to give you this. Please take it and say nothing. Looks like you got the receiver phone. Oh, I must be in your way. Zip. Huh. Interesting. I wonder what that does. Receiver phone. Apple Queen's invention. Now you can receive important calls. Only receives calls. You can't make outgoing calls from it. Alright. Well, that's sort of cool. Greetings. I'm Orange Kid. The oh, right. Yes. Repeating dialogue as usual. Yes. Oh, goody. Yes. Thank you very much. Your support should have a tremendous impact on all mankind. Let me give you my new super orange machine. I call it Superma. Superma for short. Isaac got the Superma. Please use it for spreading peace and goodwill on Earth. Uh, well, it depends what it does. I can eradicate the opposite, perhaps. Let's see. Zuporma, Orange Kid's Invention. The full name is Super Orange Machine. The Zuporma sang a song, Ode to Orange Kid. As soon as it finished, the machine broke down. Did I honestly spend $200 on that? Yeah, it's, it's not even in my inventory anymore. I'm hard at work. Don't worry, my brilliant adventure will be ready soon. Okay, okay, I'll get back to work. It fucking better, dude. Okay. Well, with that, I think I will finish this episode here. So... Thank you guys so much for watching. Actually, I don't think that we've talked to all these people. This town's bus system is a little strange. Be sure to check the bus stop signs. I wonder who came up with this system. I was in the last war, so I'm not scared of ghosts. Actually, I'm more scared of my old lady. <laughs> take the bus, or to not take the bus. Hmm, I get scared pretty easily. That's right, I'm a bus driver. For now, I'm resting. Life is long. Take it easy, chubs. Why don't you go check out your town map and learn more about this area? Chubs. Alright, what if I check this then? Danger! Do not stand on the street! Read the schedule from the sidewalk. As I can check the bus schedule. Looks like the next bus will come pretty soon. Hot damn. <laughs> Random head out of nowhere. Yep, this is the bus to three, but I'm not sure if we can get there or not. The fare is two bucks. Do you wanna go? Sure? Okay, let's give it a shot. I have a feeling this could get ugly, though. Damn. <laughs> I feel like one of the cranky ladies or, um, new age retro hipsters are gonna jump out into the road. Oh god. Oh lord. You should turn off the fucking music, my man. <laughs> what? For some reason, the bus turned to Tucson. Yep, just like I thought. Okay, I'm starting to get the creeps. We're going to back to the bus station. You wanna get off here? Uh, no. I like this music, though. 
I couldn't have been more off key. All right. Wait, this is the wrong way. Oh. Interesting. Well, then, on that note, I will end the episode. So, thank you guys so much for watching. If you enjoyed this video, then please leave a like and subscribe to join the Chorus Rebellion. If you have any suggestions for games for me to play or is to make my commentating more enjoyable, don't hesitate to leave a comment. Uh, that's about it. See ya.